Hey everybody, I'm Blitz. Welcome back to another episode of Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. Meet Dave. This is Dave. Dave's friend Dave. <laughs> Crossing the swords. Yep, that's it. So, uh, this is a another viewer suggestion video as always, because I'm, frankly, I'm, I'm totally out of ideas. Uh, yeah, um... Basically, if you guys do have any suggestions or anything you want to see, go ahead and leave it down below in the comments. And we'll do the best we can do to get to it eventually, maybe, if I can see it. Because there's a lot of comments you guys suggest. And if you do like one more than the rest, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Ooh, Dave won. <laughs> Neat. <laughs> you go ahead and give it a thumbs up, and I'll do the best. I, I can see the top ones easier, the ones that have been that, that have the, the thumb marks by them. Is there a tent? Has these tents always been there? I don't remember that. Dun dun dun. So who's gonna win? Who's gonna win this time? My guess is on blue. I think blue. Blue feels more overpowered, more powerful. Ow. Yeah, blue wins. Blong blong. Giggle giggle. Hey, buddy. Next up, this is a suggestion by Doug E. And it is to do a shield wall around with 25 shields filled with farmers, 25 farmers against 50 barbarians. I thought it was an. Hey. Ha! <laughs> Whoopsies! These are spear dudes, not uh, not the other ones. Well, let's see what happens. Shoot! That was dumb. Wow, barbarians are clubbing them to death and stuff. And that's kind of the goal, is to club them to death. That one's climbing! What are you doing climbing? Wow! Get him! Wow! <laughs> oh, well, that was that totally not what I expected. I mean, totally not what I really had planned, because those are spear guys, not, not farmers. Oh, not shieldmen. A dude just fell on us. Nope. Always fun in games till you get your spear stuck on the ground. Let's try this one instead. So we still have the farmers in there. We've got the shields around this time. Looks like they're parting the waters rather than going out. Oh, did you see that guy just get him? That was awesome. Here we go. Get clubbed. Get dead. Get wrecked. I don't. I can't really tell who's winning right now. Looks like blue still might have the upper hand. The comments were suggesting that uh, that the shield men and the farmers are going to win whole handedly. Uh, probably. These shield guys are really powerful. What's going on here? Uh-huh. Oh? Yeah, see, they can't get to the... They got this whole flanking... Wow! Get him! Get him, dude! Oh. <laughs> oh, that is... That is... Wow! I mean, to add insult to injury. Are you kidding me? Just carrying the dead dude around after violating him like that? That's that's horrendous. We got one one blue dude left. Here, have your buddy. See if he can win. He might have a chance. Especially oh he's not he's done now. The farmer is gonna take care of him. You know, poked him in the butt. Yep, he's done. I wanna do that one again. That one was kinda fun. I added five poachers in here to make it a little more exciting. They should turn the tides a little bit. Or just kill their buddies, which will likely happen. <laughs> we'll see, yeah, he's already got that dude's got two arrows in him already. Yeah, you're... Mr. Poacher, you're not that very good in life. Uh, well, and then these guys. This is the counter counteroffensive over here. This one. See, this is the poacher that we want in our, on our team. He's going to sit there and he's going to shoot the dudes right in the back. And they come over. Oh, this is going to be good. This is going to be a good fight right here. Oh, what a clubbing. Here comes another one. Get him. There it is. He's down. He's down. Turn your back to the poacher. He did it. Poacher got him. Here we go. Wow, another good hit. This is, this guy, it must be Dave. Dave got a new weapon today. Oh, oh, that would hurt so bad. I bet you wouldn't even feel it, it would hurt so bad. We got one dude left. Poachers have turned the tide of this battle for sure. Barbarian doesn't know how to, oh, there it is, blue victory. Yeah, so that was pretty good. I like that one. This is a really cool suggestion. I'm thinking it's more of like uh I don't know. Well, it says it's the British versus the Indians, so I'm guessing um, back in the, the colonial wars, the British colonial wars. This is two chariots on the left, a ten footmen, ten shields, two cannon crew, versus the Indians being five footmen, five poachers, twenty farmers, twenty peasants, and five spearmen. I put the, the British together in kind of a unit. Well, I, I mixed everything else up. Look at this, though. The money spent 3,000 versus 1,250. We'll see how it goes. Oh, see these chariots. That's going to be, I, I think the chariots are what's going to turn the deal here. Everyone's going to go for them. Hopefully they can kill it right away. Oh, the, the chariot's down. 
And these uh, cannons might mess it up a little bit. And the guys are going to get stuck together like usual. Poachers might help. I don't know if we have the closing distance to get in there and take out the, the cannons, though. That's going to be the hard part. Because they're just going to the flock together. Did you just dodge a cannon? Oh, nope, you didn't dodge. Yeah, the cannons are going to take care of them. Maybe. Yeah, they're just going to sit still now. Ow. That was close. So close that it must be done again. If they can take out the chariots right away, I don't think it'll be too big of a problem. I should maybe put the spearmen up front. Um, kind of in a group. We could change it up. Okay, they're down. Ooh, the cannons are taking out their own team. Here we go. Oh, that was a good shot. Take out right here. Wow! <laughs> my, my goal here is to get a cannonball in my own face. Ah. Okay, he's down. Everyone's down except this crew. A ragtag group. They're getting... Here's Dave! Dave leading the charge! Oh, he dodged one! Good job, Dave. He did it. Dave did it. Go, buddy. Go, buddy. Go, but. Whoops. Go, buddy. Go, buddy. Go, buddy. Poke him. Poke him to death. Poke him to death. Poke him to death. Poke it really good. Yes! Blue victory! Oh, now now we gotta do best two out of three, right? Because it's it's tied 50-50. Got Mr. Spaghetti Ming Man Wiggly Wiggly McGee over here. Go away, blurry stuff. Uh-oh. The chariot made it through the first pass. He got it? Oh, man. Dude was swiping. Okay, it's down. So far, so good. Oh, man. The, the swords are going strong today. Are you going to go after it? Where are you going? You're going to go take out these guys. The longer the cannons are up, the more difficult it is for blue team to win. I think red team's got this one this time. Uh-oh. Dave just died. It's up to you, Fred, Bill, Steve, whatever your name is. All of the above. Generic male name. I mean, I don't even know if they're males. They're just kind of... It's kind of that thing. Here's another really good suggestion by Zikaram. Two ballistas, four chariots, ten footmen, and Barney, which are on this side, versus five camera... Ha, cam... Ha, blah, 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 cannonmen. Cannonmen. That's kind of a hard word to say. <laughs> cannonmen. Cannonmen, cannonmen, cannon... Cannonmen, cannonmen... Oh, well, we got... They're down to four already. See, this is the... Wow. You just totally dumbed that up. What, one's down. One and a half. See, I don't think... I think we've tested it before that... Like, one chariot can take out a whole pack of... Oh, oh great. Yeah, that's not gonna work very well. We tested it before that one chariot can take down, like... F a, an entire board of cannons, right? Let's just try it again. Maybe the cannonmen can, can get a good couple fires off right away. And I put them way in the back, too. Tell you what. Um, once this is done, we're going to put the chariots in the back, so maybe they'll run over their own people. Chariots are in the back. Barney's still alive. Took out one, dude. And, man, that's not, not working very well. Just to don't have the reload time. That's the problem. Yeah, that's that don't work very good at all. Here's a really good suggestion by Leslie. The zombie outbreak. The red side is the humans with 25 shields. They're the riot police. 15 barbarians. Five poachers and five archers versus 70 peasants, 10 boxers, five in the front, five in the back, and then Dave. Dave's in, Dave's there. Let's see how this goes. Zombie Dave. Oh, yeah. A big old rambling mess of zombies coming in here. La, la. Oh, here we go. The, the riot police are in the front. Looks like we're shooting each other in the back, the armored cops. I'm going to see. We're going to keep the red team as as it is right now. And we're going to keep adding peasants until the blue team overwhelms the red team. That's going to be the goal. It might not be that bad. Off. Well, maybe. Let's see. The peasants, uh, the poachers are still doing good. The archers kind of just are dumb like usual. That's fine. <laughs> Speaking of dumb archers, you can tell the different bolts too. The archers have the arrowhead on, the others don't. A broadhead? I guess it would be an arrowhead. Broadhead is an arrowhead, isn't it? Okay, added 50 more? I don't remember how many I added. Uh, to 80... 40 more. 39 more. Let's see how this goes. The boxers? The boxers might turn the battle. They're pretty strong. Ooh, took an arrow to the knee. Used to be a zombie like you. Till I took an arrow to the knee. That guy took a... Took one to the head. 
Oh, they made it through. Zombies have broken through. Shoot them down. See, this is going to be the problem over here. They're going to come in here and take out the archers. I'm not concerned. Oh, what are... Get off of them. No, you just shot your archer, buddy. Stop it. Stop. There it is. Turn, turn, turn. Oh, boy. That's that's way too bad of a deal. I had a way too many. I had a way too many. Where's Dave? Where's zombie Dave? No, great. <laughs> There's two left. Can they do it? Can they... Excuse you. Blah, 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 blah. Oh man, the zombies are after him. He's down. Here it comes the zombie horde. There's Dave. Dave got the kill. It looked like Dave's chopped down with the sword right at the end. I took out a bunch. I, I want it to be even. And it hasn't been even yet. That first volley worked pretty good of, of poachers. Or archers, I guess. The poachers probably killed their guys in the back. Oh, they broke through over here. That's good. Good news on this side. Looks like this front is a lot has held a lot better too. So now, yeah, our poachers and our archers are still gonna mow them down. I think this will win. It took out like 30 guys or so, 25 or so. As long as we have a few people just distracting them over here. Like this guy. Fred. Charles. Oh, that's an archer! Archer Blast. Oh, do you see that? It just took him out. We got three left. Wow. Here it comes. Here it comes. Take him down. Take him. No, don't you dare die. Don't you dare die. Don't you dare. Run. Nope. He's dead. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. Shoot him. Shoot him. Here it is. One last shot. Nice. Nice and good red victory. Okay, for the final one today, it's by Daniel Devera. It says, 200 archers versus 100 shieldmen. This has been something I've wanted to test out for a long time. I have no clue if this is, you know, load. It did load. I don't know much more about that. It's the archer army. Oh, this, this is gonna be good. Oh, there's the first volley. Anyone go down? We did lose one or two, maybe a few more. Oh boy. <laughs> I can I can feel the leg going. We might need like half of these archers. Ow, oh, this is gonna get really painful when they go in the middle. I'm doing the best I can with the camera, too. It's a little bit tough with this many people. Go, go, go! It looks like... I, I'm guessing that the archers are going to win. Um, they've taken out a lot of these shield guys. I should have just done a half a battle so we could actually see what's going on. Look at this one over here. This guy on the far left. Oh, he just jumped! He's got his backside. Is he going to take him down? I can't tell now, and it looks like a lot of the shield men are just starting to leave. That's one problem with this game is some of the times the guys just decide to, that they're gonna quit. You know what's gonna you know what's gonna happen is that the the shield men are just gonna take out all of these guys with the shields. I'm guessing that's gonna be it. I can't I still can't move. And they're leaving. Now, yep, that's the problem. The shield guys just decide they just decide they're gonna go away and leave and quit. Um, without finishing the fight. Red team wins! Yay, go red team. I have to, to make it more interesting. The archer army. Ooh, that was cool. Some went down right away. Here we go. <laughs> I love it. The, the front lines always die. That's the worst. The worst. I mean, they haven't even got there yet, and half of our archers are dead. That's, that's bad design. Really bad thing to do. Um, <laughs> shoot. I should have thought of that. I didn't, I didn't, I don't know why I didn't think of that. How many shield guys? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 19. Yeah, I got about 30 of the 100 down. Maybe a little more than that. You can't quite count them right. I can't count. Can't count. Yep, that's the last one right here. The last one. Goodbye, buddy. I alternated the archers a little bit. Let's try this again. Hopefully they won't kill each other off so fast. And I, I don't know the number. Oh yeah, they didn't die. Well, some of them did. I mean, some of them always die. Would you just stop being blurry? Look at that. Shield line. Oh yeah. yeah see, that's when it, they start dying is when they all compact into each other. That hurts right there. Oh, get in there. Get him. Shoot him in the back. Shoot him in the back. I, I wonder if poachers would be better. I'm not going to take the time to go through it all right now because, uh, frankly, it's pretty annoying having to, to set up all these things. It'd be nice if there was a copy-paste function where you could copy a, a setup of some sort. Um, this is kind of even. 
I think we're we're still gonna have red team death here. What are, what are you guys shooting at? You're like bloop. <laughs> you just this guy just whoop. There it goes. Just uh, firing firing your missiles. Take a nap and fires the missiles. That guy died. How did he die? <laughs> I don't. Um. You're like the world's worst archer. Seriously. Boop. <laughs> Boop. I love where the arrow just kind of plops out. No, we got one in the shield this time. And everyone's coming over here. Oh, there it is. Blue victory. Obviously. What are you doing? Anyway, guys, that'll do it for today. Hope you've enjoyed the video. If you did, let me know. Give me some more suggestions. And keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time.